But even before Cohen pleaded guilty this morning, Trump was raging on Twitter about the Mueller investigation. When will this illegal Joseph McCarthy style witch hunt, one that has shattered so many innocent lives, ever end or will it just go on forever? After wasting more than $40 million, is that possible? It has proven only one thing there was no collusion with Russia. So ridiculous. You can tell he's upset by the number of adjectives he's using. <laughs> when will the Joseph McCarthy, unfair, not cool, Spanish Inquisition esque, one eyed, one horned, flying purple mullet investigation end? <laughs> and I love how he says, more than $40 million, is that possible? <laughs> no, it's not possible. <laughs> because two days ago, you said it cost $30 million. <laughs> Mueller spent $10 million in two days? Turns out they print their indictments on the Shroud of Turin. <laughs> of course, they don't know how it's printed on there. They, yeah, Scientists yeah, don't know how that indictment's there. printed on there. Wow. No, it's a miracle. Yeah. Of course, <laughs> with all the people involved, the Mueller investigation can be hard to follow sometimes. It's like Game of Thrones, but without the nudity, thank God. Oh, <laughs> and now, Please. now, Please. now, Big fans of having clothes on here. <laughs> and now we're learning about another character, political commentator and balloon full of soup, Jerome Corsi. <laughs> As I told you last night, Corsi is a right-wing conspiracy theorist who's in hot water for lying to Mueller about his knowledge of WikiLeaks' plan to release hacked DNC emails to influence the 2016 election. You know, the collusion. <laughs> so, what do you do? when you're potentially facing jail time for lying to the FBI. Lie low, talk to your lawyer, learn how to make a shiv from a chicken cutlet. <laughs> or, or, go on MSNBC for a chatty tell-all interview, which is what he did. And if you want to know how it went, here's the headline. Key Mueller witness, I lied and I'm ready to die in jail. <laughs> At which point, Michael Cohen said, Jinx, owe me a Coke. So, what is the point of Corsi's self-incriminating TV appearance? Well, it turns out Corsi's performance might just be for one viewer. I'm not counting on Donald Trump for anything, including a pardon. I, that's not the basis on which I made my decision. I don't... Donald Why Trump, are you bringing up a pardon in a well, television because that's interview? Everybody, you were talking about it before. Everybody but I didn't talks, ask you about the pardon. Okay, well, You're bringing up a pardon. I'm bringing it up because I want to make it clear I don't expect one. I'm not asking for one. Yes, uh, <laughs> pardon me. I beg your pardon. I'm not asking for a pardon by repeatedly bringing up pardons. Pardon? Also, you know who I love? Dolly Pardon. Just so... <laughs> so talented. We got a great show for you tonight.